Every time an inmate is released from prison, officials say organizations are waiting to help convicts find the resources they need to re-enter society and avoid going back to prison. And here in Kern County, there are a number of places offering services such as job placement, housing assistance, and at time rehabilitation programs. 23 ABC's Lesla Gooden has more on how they're working to make a difference to those who are at risk. Lesla. That's right. Today we spoke with Garden Pathways, who are one of the many organizations who provide these free services, and they share the importance of them and how it impacts the community. There's somebody's son, somebody's father, somebody's brother, somebody's sister, somebody's daughter, and we have to start working with that identity, right? We cannot be demonizing individuals and then expect a different outcome. Juan Avila, Chief Operating Officer for Garden Pathways, a nonprofit organization, says that their goal is to transfer lives from the inside out through loving mentoring relationships. We offer comprehensive mentoring services to individuals that are facing life challenges, and these life challenges can uh, vary from substance abuse, uh, from uh, homelessness to former incarceration. Avila says after the individuals are assisted in securing the basic needs, as far as housing and healthy living, they will then be guided to do a self-directed job search. Be able to then achieve uh, their employment or educational goals. Uh, we help them become job ready. Uh, we have a great partnership with West Tech, uh, where they earn certifications in industry recognized uh, employment. Garden Pathways says they are not the only organization that offers resources and that they partner with other programs because without them, it wouldn't be possible to do it all. It takes uh, strategic collaboration amongst a lot of agencies in order for us to meet the needs and ensure that this individual heals completely, um, that they're able to uh, reintegrate into society and uh, become a productive member of our community. 23 ABC reached out to other programs for inmates such as New Life Recovery and Residential and Training Center who said they did not have a comment on the story and the Bakersfield Reentry Center was also not available. Live in studio, Lozal Gooden, 23 ABC, connecting you.